Hey everyone, Dr. Bobby here. Over the next couple of videos, we're gonna be going over some shoulder mobility exercises. Now, this is important because if we lack control in the shoulder joint, specifically the scapulothoracic joint, that, that shoulder blade that sits on top of the rib cage, that can lead to uh, weakness and then it can lead to overcompensation, which can give us some shoulder issues. So to start, you can get in front of a wall or you can do it in the air if you don't have a wall, um, and you're going to keep your uh, abs and your back tight so you're not rotating from down here. Arm against the wall, keeping the elbow straight, you're going to bring that shoulder back, just pulling it back as far as you can go, and then pushing it forward as far as you can reach out without rotating your body. Now you may only be able to achieve a small amount of degrees in the beginning, but you'll eventually get more and more motion. And you can also go from different heights, so from top down, pulling and feeling that engagement back through here, and then from the bottom up, making sure not to shrug your shoulder up just like this, but keeping that shoulder nice and long and pulling from down here in that thoracic, or the scapulothoracic area. So do that about four to six times, and you should feel a little bit of a, fatigue in the back of that shoulder blade. Try that in your warm-ups, and we're gonna start to regain some of that control, motor control in the shoulder joint, so that way we're not forward rounding posture all the time. So give that a shot, comments and questions below, and thanks for watching.